What's up everyone? Flying Scorpion here and today we're going to be quickly showing how to capture Avakea in the new Heart of Dimos open world. So what you're going to do is you're going to go to the Cambian Drift and you're going to pull out your Trank Rifle. While you have the Trank Rifle, when you hold down M, you will see a spawn location for all of the different animals. So all of these blue icons here are locations where you can start capturing animals. If you want to specifically filter them for the Avakea, hold down 2, pull out the Avakea lure, so you're holding that lure in your hand, hold down M, and it will filter them down just to the Avakea spawn location. So we've got one inside of a cave right here. This tip was brought to my attention by tact, Tactless Tortoise. If instead of the rifle you equip the calling item, it shows only the one that belongs to the corresponding animal, that is a huge tip. So thank you, Tactless Tortoise. This video is actually my second tutorial on how to capture Avakea. I will leave a, or a link in the description below for the first tutorial. Um, but we're going to go ahead and capture one right now. So we've already marked the waypoint. We're going to fly there. If you notice that when you switch to your arc wing, you actually put away your trank gun. You can actually switch back and forth to the trank gun by key binding it. So if you go to options, go to custom key bindings, and down here, uh, gear hotkey numbers can be bound to the mouse buttons. So I bound my hotkey number five to mouse button five. So if I hold down Q and I go to the trank rifle, I can do it this way, or I can just, as you can see, switch back and forth by just clicking my mouse button. So that's uh, one way to quickly get in and out of the trank rifle. Switching to arc wing, trank rifle's gone. Um, if you're noticing little annoying quality of life issues with this entire tranquilizer uh, conservation system, uh, I just want to let you know that I watched the dev stream last night and Digital Extremes is aware of the issues and they're working on it. Uh, so yeah, hopefully or maybe by the time you watch this video, uh, they will have improved upon the system. So I think there's going to be an Avakea right here, right next to this Predacite. I can actually delete this. Yep. There we go. So we're going to start tracking the animal, press X. If you're having difficulty seeing the footprints, just jump up in the air and aim glide. Jumping up, as you saw that, right? You saw that. Jumping up seems to highlight them. So there you go. So they're going this way. And uh, let's see if we can quickly capture this thing. You can use Equinox or um, Ivara to put them to sleep with your abilities. That can be another way to capture them. All right, so there we go. We're at the spawn location. We're going to kill the enemies that spawn nearby because it almost always spawns enemies that will be annoying and they will mess with your capture. Okay, I don't see anything on the radar. I think we're ready to capture this. Pull out the echo lure. Now, when you make the call, you're going to hear it call back and turn the camera around to hear the direction. So it was in this direction. Uh, Digital Extremes is, I'm sure they're aware of the feedback of how annoying Nora Knight can be uh, while you're in the middle of doing stuff in the open plains. I think for most of us, we don't want to see any more of Nora Knight stuff. We're done with that, except for the last, uh, the last um, thing. Anyway, go ahead and make the call. You're trying to locate an Avakea. My first inclination would be to simply look up. Yep, and he's correct. Look up, at, maybe at like a 45 degree angle. Time to smash some glass. There it is right there. So what it'll do is it'll actually fly directly above you. Um, let's go ahead and kill these annoying enemies that are going to come towards us. Thank you, Nora Knight. Please stop spawning enemies. We're not looking for combat. We're looking to capture Avakea. So eventually what they'll do is they'll fly directly above you, like completely. You can hit them. You can hit them with uh, an ability to put some to sleep or just shoot them with a trank rifle. So let's just see if we can get a shot off here. Come on. 
Oh gosh. There we go. They should fall to the ground. Sometimes they glitch out and they float in the air. Capture it. Perfect capture, Comet Avachea. And that took me... I've been in the planes for a while. All right, but uh, that took not very long, just a few minutes. So if you do this and you fly in and out of the Necrolist, you can uh, respawn new locations for them. So let's go ahead and pull out our Echo Lure, hold down M. We don't see any, so you just go in and out of the Necrolist, come back out, and repeat the process. And there you go, guys. All right, everybody, thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. Have a good one.